Greetings from Texas. It's time to do a uh, battery change. My battery's toast on this 2018 Euro gear up. Also need a new one for my 2012 Tourist model, but that one I can get the battery out. There's a lot more clearance from the side. Um, so I'm gonna show you how I do it. For tools, I'm gonna use a uh, Phillips head screwdriver. I'm also gonna use an offset Phillips head screwdriver. I have a uh, hex head wrench. It's a number 10 according to my German toolkit. And a 5 16 inch box head wrench. So let me show you how to do it. Um, okay, I went ahead and removed two, but they're um, for me, and this is how I'm going to do it. To get to the battery, I'm removing the four bolts. There's two in the front and then two in the back. This is the seat mounting plate. So all you're gonna do is using my number 10 hex head, so I loosen those. You only have enough room on the front to do about a quarter turn, and you can do about 180s on these rear. Underneath these two are gonna be these small spacers. So um, there were none on the front, which I don't understand, but um, anyway, let me loosen these. Like I said, I already undid them off camera. And you're just gonna remove the seat, just like that. And there we can get to our battery. So we're gonna push all that out of the way and I'll show you what's next. Okay, what I'm gonna do next, I'm gonna use this offset screwdriver to uh, hold this bolt and the 5 16th and we're gonna spin off this nut. And I think this is a lock washer. So I'll come back when I get that off. Okay, I finally got that off. I think I'm gonna cut about a half inch off of that. So the next time it'll be a lot easier. So we're removing this front bracket. It kind of hooks on onto the base plate. And we'll go ahead and undo our terminals. You just got to keep wiggling and moving things around and you can also bungee that kickstart lever down oh. all right there we go well you got to watch me struggle and get that out so you do need to take that top plate off though uh, to get to those connectors it just makes it a lot easier just for the four bolts so all right, that's how I did my battery removal, and I'll just do it the reverse when I get the new battery. Thanks for stopping by, and thanks for watching.